As we mentioned at the beginning of the show, today the Autobahn Indoor Speedway is celebrating its grand reopening. In less than two hours, the official event kicks off and it runs until 10 o'clock tonight, so you've got plenty of time. The festivities will benefit Wounded Warrior Project, and the track now has hand-controlled carts for adaptive athletes. So we send things out to Melanie, Richard, Lena. Are they going to pop up over our shoulder? I knew it. Look at them. Melanie, They're having too much fun. How did you get this job? <laughs> oh, man, I was assigned it. You know, I only do what I'm told around this place. And so the boss said, come here. And I said, OK. So they are having a good time. This is a four way. What's it called? What is this? What is this? Galaxy Collision Air Hockey, people. This is when it gets good. This is when it gets fun. So. Audubon had none of this before. This is to attract people of all ages. And Sarah, if you come over here with me while they continue to play this game, I want to show you some of the carnival games that you can play. I think my five and my seven-year-old would love some of these. I mean, have you ever seen a ball pick up? that big usually you're getting candy on this but this is extreme pickup and then there's all kinds of carnival games for the little ones as well and just fun stuff and if you look through there they still have the axe throwing which has been very very popular here at the autobahn so we are having a good time guys i mean i don't know who's winning this game i'll come back over here to this air hockey to see um who's who's winning here who R richard Richard, Richard is winning. Richard, you are very competitive, very competitive. What a distraction here might give somebody the heads up oh, on this. No. Maybe just a little distraction no. in your ear. This How is, you doing? Oh, Lena just got a point. Lena just the, got a point. This is the best hockey game ever. What, what was best that? Best hockey game ever. Best hockey game ever. Because usually it's just two players, but now there are four. This is where it gets happy. All right, so explain. You all really did change a lot of things here. You added the games. You added the restaurant. What was really the goal to try to kind of freshen it up? Racing themed entertainment destination. So we have the go-karts as our focus, but we added something for everybody in the family to do. So if you have kids under eight and they can't do the go-karts, now they have something to do, but adults love the games too. We added the VR for a different experience as well. So this is something that everybody in the family could do. You come out, spend a few hours, hang out, grab lunch, grab dinner, and just make it an event. Yeah, and we are going to get a little taste test coming up pretty soon. You all like have <laughs> my sponsors: Victory Lap, Yangling Beer, and Barbecue. Yes. Did you just win? I did. I just won. Are, again. are you sure? I'm because born winner. I saw Lena do something pretty powerful. She's walking away here, but she had a good hit here. She had a good goal. Would you say you won or Richard? Um, I would say that I had the most spirit, yeah, okay. um, but Richard. Probably won by technicality. Oh, technicality. So he won by points. I just had heart. Okay. Hey, hey. It's heart that matters. So again, let's like just say we have two and winners. And my sponsors, Victory Lap Social, as well as Yingling <laughs> and Barbecue. This is what happens when they let us out of the stadium. It gets a little crazy. So coming up in the 9 o'clock hour, I think we're going to do some taste testing. Richard is going to eat I just got a new food. sponsor. I'd like to thank Bold City and Intuition. Oh, my goodness. All right. So stick with us. It just gets crazier here on The Morning Show. Back to you guys in the studio.